Hello everyone, welcome to Bird Tricks. I am here with Jesse from Animal Wonders Montana. If you haven't seen our collabs in the past, you need to go check out those videos, but we're back here in 2022 and I'm so excited to be yeah. here. You guys asked when we asked you what you guys wanted to see, you said that you wanted to see a blindfold game. So <laughs> I'm going to do an awful job at playing this blindfold game. Can you explain what this game is? Because this started on your channel. Uh, yeah, I know, it's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> this is all you're doing. Um, and yeah. walk them through like what this is. Yes, you blindfold yourself or someone else and then they have to guess what the animal is that's in front of them. There's a couple different ways that you can guess the animal, like... Is there though? <laughs> <laughs> you can guess them based on sound. So I could bring in like... A dog. <laughs> <laughs> or smell. No, no. <laughs> um, or touch. Oh, so many options. <laughs> <laughs> so it's your choice. Okay. Um, touch, okay. What are we gonna do, touch? So many So just choices. nice, cute. <laughs> Or just all the rabbits. I'm not agreeing to anything. The fox? <laughs> a human child at this point? I'm, I don't know a lot of other animals, as my channel probably knows. I'm not, You've met quite a few. I mean... Yeah. I mean, I think I would be able to guess a porcupine, but other than that... I, I won't make you touch a porcupine. Thank you. Um, but other than that, I kind of feel like a dog, maybe. I could figure out a horse but I don't think any of those are in the play today. <laughs> <laughs> nope, nope. So if you've never watched our channel, we have a lot of different animals. We rescue displaced wild and exotic animals. And so we're gonna steer clear of humans um, and horses and dogs today. And we're gonna venture into the more exotic land. <sighs> okay, all right. And I'm just gonna be really still. You can do this. You can I do can it. Do are all we right. starting? Yeah, go ahead. <sighs> be nice, Jesse. <laughs> I, I actually haven't chosen what animals I'm going to do yet because it it depended on if I was getting stinky animals or like, <laughs> you know, loud animals or, you know, touchables. Would I know what stuff smells like? Okay, it's fine. We'll just do whatever. I shook my head and she couldn't see. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm trusting you, Jesse. <laughs> if you can't get it by touch, how about you can smell it as well? Okay. okay. I don't think it's going to help me, but okay. <laughs> All right, I will be right back. Okay. Can we just make this a prediction game instead? I think the first one, it got shadowy, um, <laughs> is gonna be a chinchilla. I think she's gonna be nice and like warm me up with a, a soft animal. Are you moving? Dave. <laughs> Dave! <laughs> Not cool, babe. I knew you're up to something and you're just like freaking silent. We're off to a great start. I think I'm sweating. Are you ready for this? Yeah, I've told myself that it's a chinchilla and okay. that you are going to feel really nice just giving me something really soft and sweet. So go ahead and turn your hands over. You're going to touch the top of this animal. So lift your hands up. I'm going to put your hand, the animal underneath and okay. then you touch. Now? Yep. <gasps> Is it a chinchilla? Pull your mic like um, blindfold off. Pull it off. Is that a chinchilla? Oh, chinchilla. <laughs> you did a good job. I just predicted it that she would be nice to me on the first one. Oh my gosh, this one's adorable. This is Chex. This is not the normal coloration of chinchilla. She is a shedding. color morph and she's shedding a lot. Yes. She's beautiful. You're so cute. I want to run and play. Now I'm scared of every other animal that's going to come after you. <laughs> this is the only one I was looking forward to. Give it a try. What does she smell like? <laughs> so much hair. I don't know. A camel? Hmm. What does she smell How like do to you? you? Use a camel as a <laughs> 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 like Lemon. It smells like bo. No, it smells like camels. <laughs> I do smell like this. She smells like dust and pee. <laughs> oh. oh, she's shedding so much. We're all like trying to pull hair out of her. Eyes. Yeah, it got all in my face and my mouth. So I was right. <laughs> Camel. Camel. She said dust and pee. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have a 100. percent I think I should just stop <laughs> while I'm ahead. Dave, don't come near me and like mess. Okay, I'm predicting the next one. 
What are you doing? Dave! I'm predicting the next one is going to be like a lizard. Do you think she'd bring a lizard though? Because they're not very nice. Maybe. <laughs> I feel like you're messing with me. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Okay, from here I'm guessing a lizard because I'm, um, what do they call it when you can predict stuff? Psychic? Yeah. <laughs> oh, gee, oh, that. <laughs> I heard that. All right, do the same thing with your hands. All right, I'm putting the animal underneath. Now you lower. Oh. 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 Both hands. <laughs> you can go to your right. Further to your right. That's away from its head. Oh, this there, way? Yes, yes. Oh. oh, my God. Oh. Oh, it's a big lizard. You got it. Big lizard. Go ahead and take your blindfold off. Oh my gosh! You did it! <laughs> her name is Blueberry. <gasps> she has a blue tongue. Yeah. I've actually seen you. Mm -hmm. Aw. Okay, well, your name makes me feel a little bit better. <laughs> what did it feel like when you were touching her? Scales. Yeah. And so I wasn't sure if it was like long, thick, big. I was too scared to figure it out. You did good. You did good. <laughs> um, so you have, like, I bring the animal out and you're like, that's a chinchilla. And then you feel it. And then you're like, that's a lizard. And then you feel, I'm like, what? I know. <laughs> because I figured you'd be really nice to me. And then you'd want to, like, freak me out. But now I'm not sure where you're going to uh, go. <laughs> uh, uh, uh -huh. So you're, you're reading me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm like, she's not gonna want me to freak out in the very beginning. How huge you is want that tongue? Um, yes. Does she have teeth? Yeah, but not sharp ones. They're just like okay. smashy ones. So flat smashy. Ones. Yeah, <laughs> she, she smashes snails. Really? Yeah. So support her body. Okay. And that's oh, it. you're swimming. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Yep. Yeah. I'm good. Good job. <laughs> Blueberry is really different. She's missing her toes. So. Someone gave her an improper home and she was unable to shed the scales off of her toes. And so they oh. all the scale constricted over and over and over and eventually became a tourniquet and her toes died. Oh my gosh, so off. these aren't toes? So the or last, you mean nails? So she should have, her toes should be about this long and then she should have little nails at the end. Oh. So she has half of a toe on her back foot there, Oh. but the rest of it has died and fallen off. That's crazy. Yeah. So she's old. She's like 16 at least, which is really old for these guys. They can live up to 20, but she's been through a lot. And most of them are like 12 to 15 years. Wow. When you told me the face was the that other way. way, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going I'm the wrong like, way. I'm like, she's going really close to, to, to its head. I'm like, <laughs> Thank you for directing yes. me the other way. Yes. I was like, I don't know why I was scared for that way, but I was just like, oh my gosh, I'm going left. <laughs> oh, Blueberry, you're awesome. Really All right. cool. You ready okay. for the next one? Yeah. I'm gonna go like opp opposite of my instincts. Okay, thinking, is she still, can she hear me? No. I think she might do like a, like a guinea pig or something. What's your guess? I just, <laughs> I just walked out. <laughs> A guinea pig. Okay. Uh, We're gonna I, make this one a little bit harder. I feel like you're too confident. We're going I didn't to get do right. one finger and one touch, and that's all you get. Okay. Because you're too good at this. <gasps> Is it a guinea pig? <laughs> all right. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. It's right under your finger. Go ahead and reach down. One touch. That's it. Did I touch it? Yeah. You didn't feel it? <laughs> <laughs> all right. You get one more touch. Ready? Go. Oh, another lizard. That was a good <laughs> guess. You ready? You want to take off your mask? It's not a guinea pig. Oh, sh no! Oh, I didn't yeah. know you were so scared of that. Oh. <laughs> I'm so sorry. His name is Rick. It's not a guinea He's pig. He's a good guy. <laughs> oh my god, is that a cockroach? Oh, I touched him twice. Bugs, I did touch him twice. He's oh so my good. gosh, He's I didn't big. know you did bugs. Okay, got lots of well, bugs. um, so like, why does somebody keep a cockroach? Do you, <laughs> <laughs> do you, like, is he, is he like to stay or is he like food? So he is to stay, his babies are food. Okay, all right. Should we make that better context or? Yeah, 
What do you feed him, or er, his children, too? <laughs> <laughs> so we have a lot of different animals and they need to eat. Whether they're an herbivore or an omnivore or a carnivore, they need to eat. And we could either order and buy a bunch of bugs and feed our lizards. Um, okay. Or we could, or any of our frogs and our salamanders. Or we could have a little colony of our own and then breed our own and then feed the young ones out. So that's what we do. Rick, actually, he uh, is a descendant of our 12 original rescues. Woo, the wind. And um, where do you rescue they came, they came from? They came from uh, the Fear Factor live show. <gasps> That's they hilarious. They shut it down and they had a bunch of animals and we had a friend that was working there and he's like, well, we've got this colony of cockroaches and I'm like, we Who can better? take them. <laughs> <laughs> so he's a descendant of famous cockroaches. Okay. Well, that's yeah. pretty brilliant he's reason. Just, he's really sticky right now. Yeah. Just, yeah. Do you want to hold him? Nope. I'm good. Thank you, though. I super appreciate <laughs> it. All right. So do they fly and they stuff? They don't. No wings oh, okay. for him. Um, there's 4,000 species of cockroaches. And this is only like 30 of them are like really pest ones that will like come into human homes. These guys, they want to avoid humans at all costs. They hang out in Madagascar and he has really, he can hang oh, on really yeah. tight. I, yeah. I think Jamie should hold him. She just peeled him off of her hand. He was just holding on. He has a little claw. Hold like, hands nice and still so I can get him focused. Give me a second. It's all sweaty. <laughs> <clears throat> he'll either stick, right, and just like st stay, or he'll, he'll run, and if he does, I'll catch him. Okay. Oh god, 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 oh god. Ooh. I know it's weird. I know it's weird. You got this. You did it. He's chilling. Yeah. He's chilling. He is. Look at him. I am not chilling. You're doing great. Can we kiss? There you go. Nope. People people keep him as pets. They do. Why though? Does it just like hang out with them? No, they live like five years. They live longer than a rat. Yeah, but what do you do with it? You feed it like lettuce. They, they eat all things, and this they're cute. This would be a good thumbnail right here. <laughs> That's great, actually. <laughs> okay. Did it move? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, it's gonna feel weird coming up. Okay, yep. Okay, so, fun fact. You okay? Yep, I'm good. Fun uh... fact, I cried the first time I held a cockroach. Out of happiness? Nope. Oh. Because it climbed up my arm, and I had never experienced that before, and I was like, I, I am trying so hard to like this. And and it was just so much emotion. Yeah. And I'm like, it just came out as tears. And uh, it wasn't pleasant. But now mm -hmm. that I know what they feel like, like, look at those little, little doingers, like, feel in my hand. That's cute. Oh. And then his little head is under here. So a lot of people think that's their head. Yeah. His head is under here, and his eye is there, and his eye is here. Look at his little head. Yeah. That's not cute. No offense, Rick. <laughs> Jesse and I just have different definitions of cute. <laughs> like a little mustache. <laughs> you got me. I was not expecting. Pads, see was, the white sticky pads? I do. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I see them. Yay, surprise! Yeah. That was awesome. Are you, are you okay? Can you trust me for the next one? Yeah, that was not a guinea you pig. A, I mean, that was, you guessed guinea pig, but then you touched near like lizard. And Did that's you a close think that's about getting a guinea pig? I did! I did! And I'm like, <laughs> against my instinct. No. <laughs> Go more terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> Man. Okay. And what are All the right. things in with the guinea pigs, the big ones? Patagonian cavy. 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 Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I didn't expect a cockroach. I don't even know what kind of bugs she has in them. Dave. What are you doing? Oh, Dave! Stop! <laughs> God! You're so jumpy. <laughs> it feels like a dark hole in here. You doing okay? No, Dave's messing with me so hard. He put something in my ear. Oh, no! <laughs> All right, this yeah. guy. Okay, it's a male. Yes. That's not gonna help you. <laughs> oh, interesting. I can smell it. Hands up and down. Oh, sorry. You're okay. Oh, oh you can't hurt him. Just... What the heck? It feels kind of like a 
hedgehog. Or no, like an armadillo. I don't know. I don't know what that is. There's like a little bit of hair, but there's, what the heck? He's touching you. Oh! <laughs> I don't know. All right, what's your final guess? Um, Here, let me touch your hand. Armadillo? Okay, bind for love. <gasps> what you, you did, did it? it? <laughs> oh my gosh, I got it right. This is Kincho the armadillo. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I'm not so bad. How cute, That's he's funny. actually really cool looking. Yeah. Yeah. So he's a three-banded armadillo. This species is from South America, not the ones that you would find in like the United States. Wow. It was so weird to feel how hairy he is actually. Yeah, yeah you were feeling like the those little like spiky hairs yeah. almost. Yeah. Oh my gosh, yeah. that's cool. Do you wanna hold him? Uh sure. Alright, hold okay. him on his bum. Okay. And like on his like there. Oh my gosh. Yeah. He moves. There you oh go. boy. Oh boy. <laughs> so right oh. now he thinks he's stuck on his back. Okay. And so he's trying to roll himself off. Here you go. So if he if he ever I the reason I don't want you to put your hand down here is because sometimes they'll close up on your hand. What do you mean? Like go into a ball? Yeah. So he'll go all the way into a ball if he wants to. Oh, he's like a little, yeah. he's like an egg. Like, no, I don't want to. Okay. Oh, that's you don't cute. Have, but they can. They can go all the way into a ball, but what they would do is they would pinch whatever's trying to get them okay. in there. And so <laughs> it's, it's not That was nice of you the then. Time. Yeah, those claws are something else. It's like just one big old nail. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that was cool. So if he's stuck, let's see if he does it. If he's stuck on his back, Oh, it's like a dinosaur egg. You're content. He does look like a dinosaur egg. Oh my gosh, did you fall asleep? Oh, watch. He'll get. He'll do it. Yay! Oh, good job, buddy. Good job. <laughs> That's adorable. So. Oh, he's cool. And how come he can't be outside long? Um, he doesn't have enough fur to keep himself warm. Oh, so like even in this temperature, it's not okay? So he likes it like 80 to 90 degrees. Gotcha. Um, so he'll eventually start shivering <laughs> to keep himself warm. How cute. Oh, he looks so sleepy. Oh, he's nocturnal, so he's very sleepy. Oh, sorry, bud. We woke him up. We're gonna go put him back to sleep now. <laughs> it's all right, bye-bye. Yes, you're great. Yeah, oh, one more thing. You wanna smell him a little closer? What would you say that smell is? Not very good. It's, it's gross, yeah. Is it pee? Yeah. And musk and armadillo. It's just, it's just, it is. <laughs> Thanks for adding that on. It's like camels. <laughs> so what do you think it is? Maybe a frog. But she might want to go scarier since the armadillo was cute. All right, you ready for this one? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna switch it up a little bit. You're gonna hold this animal. Now, don't jerk away. Okay. Here he comes, or she, here she comes. One, two, three. Is it a frog? Want me to get your blindfold off? Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh, I predicted it. <laughs> Not a frog though. Toad? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Did you predict it? Were you talking yes. about it? No! <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> so this is Trevor the toad. Trevor. And she is a smooth-sided toad. Um, from South America. Trevor. She came with the name. <laughs> Okay. I don't think they knew, and we're like, that's a girl. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her little face, though. She's just so, like, tolerant. She's like, fine. She's really cute for a toad. Like, normally I think of toads as not cute, and she's, she has a great face and eyes. Do you know the difference between a toad and a frog? Like, are toads just bigger? Uh, no. Uglier? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm trying to, like, legitimately guess. <laughs> All right, so if you look at those two like swollen things behind her head, kind of like her cheeks. body, yeah, yeah, so those are actually her poison glands. Um, uh, so she has bufotoxin, so they're in the family, they're all frogs, but they are in the family Bufonidae. Oh. Um, and they have they have those toxin glands there, and if they get scared uh, that they're going to be eaten, they'll squeeze out poison and it tastes bad. Does it kill you? Wouldn't kill you. <laughs> it could make like a raccoon really, really feel awful. Oh, okay. Yeah. And frogs don't have, don't have that. Frogs don't have that. No. Come here, another one. And I brought you this. Oh, thank <laughs> you. <laughs> okay, she's gonna have to end on something, and I feel like she's gonna want to get me. I wonder if it's a spider. Do you think she'd bring a spider outside though? 
feel like she's gonna wanna get me on this one. Here she is. All right. She's smelling. I am going to kind of guide your hand where to touch her. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Ready? Mm -hmm. Oh. It's not a tarantula. You thought it was gonna be a spider? I thought you were gonna like really wanna trick me. Gosh, I don't know what this is though. Give it a little scratch. I want it to be the fox, but I don't think the fox would be this calm. Oh, what is this? I don't know what this is. <laughs> I don't think it's a guinea pig because they're really, really soft. You want to smell her? Okay. Oh, she does not smell good. <laughs> um. <laughs> ah. There's no way you would have brought the fox out. You want to touch? There's no way you would have brought the monkey out. Here, we'd all be done. Be <gasps> is it a fox? Is this a fox? Oh my God, is this the fox? <gasps> is that your guess? Yeah. Take your mask off. Damn it! The emotional roller coaster was amazing. <gasps> my hopes were so high when I touched that tail. I'm like, it's poofy. It's, <laughs> it's a fox. Oh man. Oh man. All right. This is Lollipop. I love a skunk. I'm oh, not disappointed. I just thought you were something she else. Up, like, right on her forehead. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. I didn't know you had a skunk. You got me. You got me. Good. I knew <laughs> you you'd want to get though. me. I'm like, you did good, though. In there? But she doesn't smell like a skunk. Like, it doesn't no. smell like a skunky spray. No. Like, yeah. It just, yeah, they just have like a general smell of like where the area that they're all kept in you know yeah. so it's hard to distinguish certain scents because yeah. it's just like i can tell they all came from a certain building that's it oh man I, I thought for a hot second she's so like, oh my gosh oh my gosh she got that fox out here and i'm like how did she do it she got it on a leash she brought it out calmly oh my gosh it didn't try to no, lick anything no the fox, no the, no she would have been like all over the place. Right? That's what I thought. I'm like, how did she do it? She's just like, okay. Yeah, she's just letting fight. me touch her tail. <laughs> oh, that was cool. That was good. Well oh, played. Good girl. Well good girl. played. Okay. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this game. That was super fun. I actually wasn't as awful as I thought I was going to be. You did really good. But I think it's because I know you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, were, you were playing me instead of the animals. Yeah. I was like, what would Jesse do? Because um, you're such a good friend. So yeah. I knew you wanted to warm me up to the concept because you know I'm such a one. I'm like, softest animal in the world. Yes. <laughs> Like, I hope it's a chinchilla. <laughs> yeah, that's what I hope. And she's so sweet. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Jesse. If you guys haven't seen Jesse here on the channel before, please go check out our latest collab. It was a while ago, but also go check out Animal Wonders Montana because she does amazing things with the animals here, and you'll get to see a variety of animals on her channel. So Thanks, thank Jamie. you, Jesse. Yeah. <laughs> and thanks, Lollipop. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That is so cute. It reminds me of when a dog like plays with you. Now this is a territorial threat display before they spray. Look, she has it right. She has it right there. See it? Yeah. There oh you my go. goodness! Look how far you can reach. Good job. Does that make you feel better? I don't have any more. <laughs> <laughs> you eat